Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. Ice creams are one of the most loved desserts and they're all the more dearer when there's fresh fruit in them. So today I'm going to make some fantastic mango ice cream with fresh fruit. It's so tempting, isn't it? I can't wait to share this recipe with you guys. So without wasting any time, let's dive right into the recipe. The first step for the mango ice cream is to make the condensed milk. To a pan, add 500 ml of milk. Next, to give a nice yellow color to the ice cream, I'm adding a teaspoon of the saffron strands. I'm just going to crush it with my fingers and just add it to the milk. So you can see the instant color change in the milk as soon as adding the saffron strands. Next, add one cup of white granulated sugar. Mix everything in. Adding the saffron will give a lovely color to the ice cream. So many of them use artificial coloring, but instead of that, you can use saffron to give it a nice color. Continue to boil till the milk reduces to a nice thick and creamy consistency. This will take roughly about 15 minutes. Maintain the flame on a medium and keep stirring the milk at intervals. So you can see that beautiful color change. It's come to a nice pale yellow color. So you can see it's come to a nice thick and creamy consistency. Transfer the condensed milk to another bowl and keep it aside. Now for this recipe, I've taken five medium-sized Alfonso mangoes, nice and ripe. Peel off the skin, chop them into medium-sized pieces and keep it aside. Add the chopped mango pieces to a mixer jar. Pour the condensed milk. and grind everything to a nice fine puree. Once you've made the mango puree, transfer it to another bowl and keep this aside. So next I'm going to make the whipping cream that goes to make the ice cream. This is very essential for the ice cream. So I'm using 400 ml of the sweetened whipping cream. If you don't get the sweetened whipping cream, don't worry about it. You can add some powdered sugar to the cream while whipping it. The whipping cream has to be nicely chilled Using a hand mixer, nicely whip the cream till it becomes very light and fluffy and it forms nice stiff peaks. Wow, you can see how silky smooth the cream has become. Now slowly incorporate the mango puree into the whipping cream and mix it all in. So once you've mixed the mango puree, using the whisk, just whisk everything once till it's all well combined. I'm going to set the mango ice cream in a nice loaf tin. You can set the ice cream in whichever container you have. Gently transfer the mango cream into the tin. Spread it out evenly. You can see how beautiful that mango cream is looking. Wow, it's so tempting already. You can see how creamy and rich it looks. The steps are very simple. And let me tell you, it's one of the best mango ice creams I have eaten. Or it's probably the best ice cream I've eaten. Place a cling wrap on top and cover it. Place the tin in the freezer and let it freeze overnight. It will need at least about 12 hours for the ice cream to set. So after 12 hours, I've set it up overnight actually. You can see how beautiful it looks. Just take a couple of scoops into a nice cup and you can enjoy this lovely, delicious, super creamy, flavorful mango ice cream at home. So I'm going to assemble the mango ice cream in a nice tall ice cream cup. I recently picked up these beautiful ice cream cups at a store. It reminded me of the ice cream shops way back in the 70s and 80s. Just add a few chopped mango pieces. Place a few scoops of the mango ice cream. Add a few more chopped pieces of the mango on top. I'm just serving it with some nice chocolate wafers. You can serve it with whatever you have at home or just enjoy the ice cream plain. So there you go, here is this absolutely gorgeous, super creamy and delicious homemade mango ice cream. Just follow all the steps and you will get it perfectly. Maximize the mango season, enjoy the ice cream and drop in all your comments and let me know how it turned out for you guys. We'll give you a couple of links for the other ice cream recipes that I have made. Do try them as well and enjoy your summer. So there you go, I've had my best scoop of homemade mango ice cream with this one. And since it's the mango season, it's a perfect time to try more exotic desserts like this. So do try the recipe, enjoy and share it with your family and friends. 
The second edition of our home cooking book is now available on our website 21frames.in. I'll give you the link in the description. You can go and check it out. The book is currently available only in India for now. So you can place your orders on 21frames.in.